Hello, it's me, Brandon Burns, aka Rally Ruffin from YouTube, of course. <laughs> and I'm gonna be, you know, recently I talked about doing another review. First was a uh, brain scan on, you know, the Series and Shield full movie collection of good, good horror movies. So I decided to do another review. This one was from 1985. It's from Columbia Pictures and it's about a scary vampire. Sorry, I didn't want to hear that. Yeah, it's a uh, Fright Night. There it is. Fright Night. It's directed by Tom Holland. It stars Chris Sarandon, who you might might really remember from Child's Play as a detective. Plays the vampire. Jerry, somebody in his kids, I think, but yeah. But it also has William Ragsdale as Charlie, the kid who lives in the store who knows that he's a vampire. He sees them when he sees when he sees sucking the blood out of the hooker. Yeah, that's when he knows it. I mean, it'd be so you might, uh, you, if I don't pronounce the last name, sorry, you, not, you might remember her from being on Mary with Children as Marcy Rose and Marcy Darcy as that neighbor who doesn't like Al, who's a feminist. Everybody knows who she is. Being a married with children fan, you know she is. But she plays Amy, Charlie's girlfriend. At the beginning, they try to have sex, and Amy said, Charlie, stop it! Stephen Jeffries as Evil Ed. I can't say that they're friends, that Charlie and him are friends. Maybe they're just associates, but they can't be friends because I know Evil Ed doesn't like Charlie very much. And vice versa. If you're watching the movie, you know what I'm talking about. And of course, Ronnie McDowell as Peter Vincent, the vampire slayer. Well, you know, the actor who plays the vampire slayer on TV. And later on, Charlie tries to get Peter Vincent to help him. Like, you're the Peter Vincent, the vampire slayer. That's, that's just a, that's just a character in the movie. That's not even my real name. I like the part when Charlie tells. Sorry. I like the part where um, Charlie tells Peter Vincent so there's a vampire living in this film, and he, Peter Vincent thinks he's crazy because there's no such thing as vampires. And so Peter believes it. Yeah, it's basically the next door neighbor, the new neighbors are. Or one of the vampire, the other one, the other one, I guess you could say he's a slave like Ringfield and Dracula. The other character named Billy, I forgot. I think it's Jonathan or Kimmy if he's stuck. It's, I think it's one of the last names stop. Maybe it's Jonathan stop. But, uh, they live in this store, and one day Charlie sees this beautiful whore comes to Jerry's house, and, you know, uh, and at one point the mother thinks the new neighbors are gay, but uh, he tells them, I don't think so. And then he hears that, ah, scream in the middle of the night. Um, sorry. And so he hears that ah scream in the middle of the night, knowing uh, you know, uh, that Jerry the vampire killed her. I'm sure when he tries to prove that he's a vampire, the police don't believe him, nor his girlfriend or his associate, Evil Ed, or of course Peter Vince. But later on, when um, Amy gets Peter Vince, paid, Peter Vince is the vampire slayer, vampire hunter. Go over to his house, try to prove that you know Jerry's not a vampire. He sees his reflection in the mirror and like, oh, oh Charlie's telling the truth, he is a vampire. And it's got it is a good movie, Fright Night. It's got some cool 80s horror music, too. Fright Night, and yes, they made a sequel. Who I don't know if it's on DVD yet, I gotta look it up. Fright Night 2. But this was also remade, and I watched the remake. The remake was, I guess, okay, was it? Cool, like the original. I prefer the original over the remake, that's just me, but I'm sure 80s, 80s fans are gonna, you know, like this better than the remake that came out in, was it 2010? Fright Night? But the original one is a cool movie about, you know, uh, William writes down, you know, as Charlie. And he was in Mannequin 2. You ever seen Mannequin 2? That was a good movie. I know. 
not really the greatest movie in the world, but it's a good movie, The Secret of the Mannequin. And, you know, Ronnie McDowell, you know who he is. He's a legendary actor. He died in 1998. And uh, I told you about Amanda, who played Marcy on Mary with Children. Chris Serrini, who, uh, he was also in Dog Day Afternoon, but that's the only, I mean, he's done other movies, but, you know, I mean, it's Stephen Jeffries. He later uh, in his career became a gay porno star. Yeah, serious. And he, he used the name of, I found this out when I was watching Spirinet's video about him. Yes, he's Spirinet, who looks like Steve Burkle. He was t- telling about the actor who t- was in Friday Night did porn. He was talking about Evil Ed's character. I mean, you know, Stephen Jeffries who played Evil Ed. I think he used the name, didn't he use the name Sam Ritter? I think it was Sam Ritter just the Avoid all the publicity, but uh, Stephen Jeffries, he was uh, in a 9176 Evil, directed by Robert Eaglin, who played Freddy Krueger. And in this movie, the character Evil Ed got on my nerves a little bit. I mean, his voice sounded weird. I mean, I'm just saying the way he, how he sounded like. On point in the movie, he tricked Charlie. Is Charlie, I've been bit by a bat. I'm gonna give you a hickey. The way he is, it's a little weird to me, but that, that's just me, though. But I really like Stephen Jeffries. He's a good actor in this movie. I'm not putting him down. I'm just putting how his character is. But yeah, check out Fright Night, 1985 from Columbia Pictures, and they did Fright Night too. And I also heard. They wanted to do Fright Night 3, but uh, the guy who wanted to, to do Fright Night 3, this is what I heard. You know you're the Menendez brother's dad. I forget his name. You know Steve, you know, uh, Kyle and Lance. No, Kyle. Oh, no, no, Lyle and Eric. Lyle and Eric, I'm sorry. Yeah, their dad. She was a movie. Was he a movie producer? I forget, but he wanted to, I think he wanted to do Fright Night 3, and that's when you know their sons killed him. That's what I heard on the Internet Movie Database and the trivia section on Fright Night 2. Maybe it's still there, but check out Fright Night. I'm about to end this video. And look at his evil eyes. And please subscribe to my channel. Please subscribe. You don't have to like me. You don't even you don't have to respect me. Just subscribe, baby. You can hate my guts forever. Just subscribe. Oh, just subscribe. You guys subscribe to the channel. Anyway, that's it. I'm out. Peace, baby.